How's it going everyone, my name is Rob. Today what I'm going to be bringing you is some more Gears War 4 information. Now guys, the Gears War 4 multiplayer information is going to get announced on March the 14th. So I'm really looking forward to that. Hopefully we can find out obviously some more information like the characters, and um, the maps, the movement and gameplay and all that kind of stuff. I'm really looking forward to seeing what we're going to be getting in the beta as well. Um, hopefully we find that out very soon because I've seen quite a lot of tweets from Rod Ferguson and people that work for the Collision saying hashtag very soon and soon and stuff like that. So they're really teasing us right now but I'm really really looking forward to it. But the next thing I'm showing you guys is on the screen right now is the picture of JD Mano kicking over the wall onto the locust but it's called the swarm. Now guys as you can see here I'm going to read something that is in the article of the game former. The Vault Kick is a new feature to the series. It is designed to let players slide over their piece of cover and kick an enemy in the face. This move stuns the enemy, leaving them open for an execution of the player or obviously a death. So guys, this is going to be quite interesting. I mean, it's obviously we've had the Mano Kick before, but this is the, the new Vault Kick. So that is going to be awesome. We're going to see this and we're going to see how it works very soon, hopefully with some gameplay and stuff like that. Um, I'm going to be reading a few other things here guys, um, obviously you can see here, this is the, the wind farm. Uh, the wind flares are devastating storms that rage across the surface of Sierra. This is in the campaign by the way. Now, not only can they fry the combatants into crispy bacon, but their fierce wind flying objects across the environment, turning anyone unlucky enough to be in the path into bloody smears. Now guys, during the demo we saw these. Um, but we saw that the player could also use this to his advantage, so by shooting signs and barricades and holding the cars and the boulders to place, they can send their enemies flying. Um, so it's really cool guys, yes, um, the corpses and the dismembered limbs and hurled into the wind farm as far as well. So it's going to be gruesome, this is going to be nasty, like, if you walk into that, you're dead. Um, but obviously if you're activating it and you're coming across the enemy, it's going to absolutely annihilate them and you'll really see the gruesomeness and obviously the, the amount of work they put in you can see the limbs flying apart and them just absolutely crushing um, another picture guys as you can see here is obviously GD knifing now this is a new thing we're gonna have melee weapons obviously in this game which I'm really looking forward to this is new this has never been happened in the Gears of War franchise so this is a new weapon a handy combat knife the execution animation is changing on whether your character is standing or in a dazed enemy the different kind of um, situations you're in it's going to be different but this is one screenshot you can see here where it's a brutal stealth execution in the middle of earth shadow of the mortar um, into the brain now this is unbelievable it looks so clean and it looks absolutely amazing so I'm really looking forward to trying this out and seeing some gameplay of stabbing in melee gameplay it just looks awesome. Now guys, this is the last picture I've got today. As you can see here, um, this is one of the swarms. These guys are called the Juvies. Now, this is one of the swarms um, partners and they're little buggers, it says. <laughs> they aren't too hard to kill or handle, but through their speedy movements and their sliminess, it makes them pretty creepy. And however, as a group that they come out in, they gang up on you and they start killing you. So kind of guys they kind of seem like a bit like wretches but like upgraded versions <laughs> that's what it kind of looks like to me so i don't know what you guys think but this is absolutely amazing these pictures they really really do look insane and i just cannot wait to see some more gears of war 4 information and all that kind of stuff but guys thank you so much for watching today hope you did enjoy this i've got plenty more videos in the making and obviously more gears of war 4 information throughout this month till the beta comes out so thank you so much for watching drop a like and i'll speak to you guys in the next video Peace.